It's not the first time police have been called to Justin Bieber's home nestled in an exclusive gated community in Calabasas, California, about 50 kilometers north of Los Angeles. Early this morning, Bieber and as many as seven others inside the house were detained while a dozen police officers executed a felony warrant stemming from an incident on January 9th when the pop star allegedly egged his neighbor's house. He has not been arrested, nor has he been exonerated. For now, the 19-year-old Stratford native remains a suspect. While eggs may have led them there, Lieutenant David Thompson says it's what's inside that caught their attention. The cocaine, I believe, was in plain view of the deputies when they were looking for the other evidence. Police confirm one man was arrested for cocaine possession, but it wasn't Bieber. TMZ reports his longtime friend, Xavier Smith, a rapper known as Lil Za, was taken into custody. The egging incident reportedly caused thousands of dollars in damage to the neighboring home's facade, and that's the key to this warrant, raising the seriousness of the crime from a simple misdemeanor. Early reports had police looking for eggs in Bieber's home, but police deny that. I get that the eggs don't seem that significant, but it does rise to the level of a felony. There is a victim in this case who had extensive damage done to their home, and that's a serious incident. To that end, the star's security system was dismantled and taken away as evidence. None of this has anything to do with him being a celebrity. This could be Mr. Bieber, this could be you, this could be me, this could be anybody. We would do this same level of crime to anyone that committed this crime. Police say while investigating past incidents, they've had no luck getting Bieber to talk to them. Detained today at his own home, they say he fully cooperated. Well, it's not over for young Justin. The police investigation into the egging incident, which prompted today's execution of the arrest warrant, continues. And if the DA proceeds and charges are found and eventually he's found guilty of the felony, well, he could serve time in jail. But that's a lot of ifs.